<laughs> I'm one of the, I'm, 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 like the no I'm fan. one of the people that likes Chipotle, man. Just saying, because like people, I, I no no no, it, no. it's stupid. I, it's good. It's good. No no, I agree. But it's like it's stupid that people are like, where would you get Chipotle? There's so much better Mexican food. It's like, dude, I don't go to Chipotle for Mexican food. Like, that is fair. <laughs> like, that is fair. Who in the right mother goes to Chipotle for Mexican food? You're like. <laughs> We'll talk to some people that really do this. So That's what I mean. I mean, some people do, but like, I know way out. better than that. Yeah. <laughs> I just like Chipotle because it's Chipotle. Exactly. <laughs> you, you don't do that because it's like, yeah, I, I agree with you, man. But anyways, grand finals, man. A matchup we saw previously. A lot of counterpicking going on in their first set uh, in the winter semis. Or, yeah. But let's see uh, if the same thing happens here. Phoenix coming from the loser's end. He's got to win two sets this time around to take the whole thing. Two sets against um, Cloud uh, should be fun for Phoenix. Cloud, Sheik. Can probably, I'm, I'm going to expect both, all four of these characters. Cloud, Sheik. Oh, there's the cross slash. And first thought gone. Dynamo in a really good lead. Right you could actually see Jump Steady point at that. Like, look, see, I died to that. What? <laughs> <laughs> There's that up there. All right, looking for oh. more uppers, but Phoenix able to get him away from this thing. Get off me! Here's my second forward Limited smash. Dude, limit saving Dynamo's life, but he had to burn it there as he wasted an air dodge. Oh, excuse me, air dodged before grabbing the ledge. 39% now. All right, yeah, dash back punish. I like it. Quick, strong. Oh. oh. He Dynamo. waited, he waited. Now we're giving him the hair dodge, and Phoenix is just reciprocating with an up there. Nice. So that, that setup right there, they uh, up there. It's like a, like a rap video, like. <laughs> you know like, every. Skitty, bop, bop, bop. Like that. <laughs> like, man's not hot. Loki, Lo like, what does every rapper these days have, like, have a hype man in the back and goes. Like, I've heard songs like that. Because, dude, you always gotta have the hype man. But as I was saying, uh, well, that's a road now. <laughs> Never mind. Let's just keep watching. Up throw. Not doing too bad. Looking at down there, Dynamo looking at Poco his way up. I would say, yeah, he has a lot more to worry than Dynamo does. Yeah. Especially now at these percents. Dynamo in limit. Oh, oh hello. That was almost a four. Swing could have definitely taken care of Phoenix, but Dynamo unable to catch that. He's got Phoenix off the stage, and he runs him all the way to the ledge, even oh, with a dash attack. Oh, no. no, he's waiting. He's waiting. He's waiting. Oh, oh, yeah, oh he had to use it. He got a little bit uh, caught up in his movement there, ended up off stage and having to burn his limit. 150%. Oh, my God, dude. This could be bad. Dynamo, we need that limit. Oh. Thankfully, uh, he does know how to auto snap, so that's good. Uh -oh. oh. Nice, he decides to go high. I like that option. Yeah, it was, it was easily. I mean, it wasn't like completely safe, but the safest thing to do. Yeah. Oh. And he catches. It's like you said, dude. One of the things that you guys, Sonic's Three love to do, run to the ledge for that spin Whoa. dash. And Dynamo says, "I know where you're going. So let me catch you, dude." See this sword and see the stock end. So do you think uh, he'll pick DK? Uh, Dude, no. everyone's getting brought food. What the Why hell? Why didn't I even get food? No one's. I'm, I'm like literally willing to pay for food. I'm calling Zeno now. I've got him a drink today, and he, he went to freaking Shake Shack and didn't even bring me fries. Look at that. Where's that from? The, the chicken place looks like right by here. I'm like actually getting food. But... We're going to make it through Grand Finals. Dynamo up one game. I mean, you better hope you're on j -Mix Dude, I'm going to punch you, dude. <laughs> He's like, literally, uh, dude, I can smell that. <laughs> j -Mix is like eyeballing this like burger, dude. He's like, dude, this burger doesn't even look like a snack. It looks like a full-on dinner. Woo. So game two. Actually, real fucking is like, it's easy for like, most people, unless you're in Europe. Dude, you're, now he's flat. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna kill him. <laughs> I'm sorry. I can't. I can't. <laughs> Meanwhile, on Dragon Ball Z, on, on Super Smash Bros. for Wii U, Dynamo 
taking a lot of damage right now. 137% back throw, putting him off stage. And the forward tilt. Yeah, that's going to force Dynamo to burn his limit. Oh, no, he oh, had it. He, had he it. caught him. He caught him out animation. of limit through the uh, forward tilt. That's crazy. Oh, there's that down air. Nice. Let's try to convert to an up air, but Phoenix not going to run into it. He's going to stay away. Forward throw. Charging limit. I mean, each time that Dynamo gets a second to charge limit, it looks like he seems to be taking it because he knows he's going to need limit to finish off Phoenix right now. Yeah. I mean, it would be great if he could uh, get the stock without it right now because then he'll have limit ready for the very next stock. Here, limit should come online right about now. And All right, Dynamo just needs that back air. He finds it. Oh! Yeah, stock. That, that was great because I was about to say... Um, he's he's at a point where he may not need to just burn the limit yeah. to keep himself in the game and not uh, let Sonic get carried away with lead. But back air was enough, and uh, now he's able to uh, even it out. Make the comeback, platform, almost cost him a little bit there. There's that mortal Phoenix running back and forth. We're going to just catch Dynamo and another spring ride. Catches him on the way down with that down air. He's been doing that so well every time, noticing when his opponents are just actually in the perfect opportunity to get down it after the spring ride. Because the empty hopping could signify that he's probably possibly going for a tomahawk or even a falling up air. Oh my god. Right. Oh, yeah. oh, he went no. for it immediately. I can appreciate it. I mean, he was just trying to end the stock right then and there. Um, still not out of the ball park yet. He can still make it happen as long as he gets one solid confirm. Once he gets the advantage, that's where it is. But uh, a dash tag like that on shield is going to cost you. Alright, Dynamo running away and charging shield. I like how he cancels the limit charge right away. He can't cancel it by pressing B again. But he's off the stage, high percent. Excellent job recovering high with that climb hazard, and he falls back down with the down air, spacing himself away from Phoenix. But he finds himself in a similar situation off the stage, and that climb hazard is going to power through that that uh, string. Once again, yeah. Oh my god, Dynamo, he's got limit back. Make this happen, man. Treating to the platforms, making sure. Uh, trying to force Phoenix to come to him at this point. Up throw, up throw still nope. not going to do it. Uh oh. But it does get Dynamo off the stage and into the platform, yeah. so Phoenix might want him. Yeah, and uh, Dynamo did miss the tech on the platform there, but because the platform was at its, like, at the highest point. Oh, oh no, he tried, but unfortunately he's still living. Oh, he had to burn recovery there. He yeah. had to. It looked like uh, he may have, like, Drifted back or, or not drifted forward as much as he wanted to because he saw, he saw the platform. And if he had landed on the platform, there was also the possibility that he just got stretchered away. Dude, you gonna go give me one or what? What the hell? What the hell? I hope, man. I hope we don't get a bracket reset, bro. We're fucking trying to go eat now, today. That's I'm freaking hungry. Nah, man. I'm, I, I want. I want a bracket reset if a bracket reset is deserved. You real, real talk, you don't want that. You really hungry. Nah, dog. You're trying to go eat. I'm, I'm real. Let's go. Let's go, Phoenix. I don't know, bro. Who are any of the kids in Sonic understand? <laughs> but, bro, how are you going to do Phoenix like that? I'm happy for him, bro. He's but, uh, great. My natural animal instincts dictate that I must eat. <laughs> Alright, it's so a 1 1 here in Grand Finals. Set 1. Falling down air, down air, Dynamo now putting Phoenix up above him in a pretty good spot right now. Excellent job with that nair, pushing Phoenix up the stage. Phoenix is falling down with that back throw. We're going to set up a possible edge guard situation, and Dynamo gets the cross slash on the way back to the stage. Pretty much sending Phoenix flying across from the right side. Sitting at 114% with more than half limit charge. Back throw, yep, there it is. Oh, I respect that. That was so nice. Oh. Shot. It looked like he may have been able to charge a slight second earlier. And if he had done it, he may have made it back. Uh, precarious situation. That was crazy. Phoenix is like calm mode off of uh, forward up to. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I've never seen that before. Yeah, yeah, he he Looking for that spring ride. 
Oh, there's that falling oh. up air. Oh! Give me a quick trade around the situation. I look like he's getting a bomb, my god. Meanwhile, Dynamo gets punched. You, you keep doing that, this is going to be a bracket reset. Phoenix is up 2-1, Phoenix is up though. Yeah, he really is. You keep doing that. You know what? Nah, I'm, I'm, I'm serious. I want the bracket reset. I want to see game five, set two, grand finals. You know what I mean? Nashmade became delusional because he's so hungry he's oh, forgotten about eating it. Sonic. Hey, trying to get that back air. Phoenix is slipping through the cracks. Able to land on that stage. Alright, this is pretty much a uh, game point. Yeah, this is Dadabo set to lose right now. He is in the winner's side of Grand Finals, so. And so far, no, no character counterpicks have just gone uh, about, about Sonic the whole way. Yeah, I never expected it too because, I mean, this is Phoenix, like, most powerful character that he has in his arsenal, honestly, that he's actually just uses in general. And for him to go near the character right now in Grand Finals, you know, it wouldn't be that questionable, but, I mean, if this is the character you main, it's best as, like I said, start out on your strong foot. Your best foot forward. And Sonic seems to be working miracles for him right now. Dynamo just air dodging away from most of Phoenix's conversion, but he finds other things like converting the Dynamo like that back air. And earlier, he tosses off that cross slash, trying to call out Phoenix on the spin dash, and he narrowly escapes it. Yeah, he was just outside of the range, but even still, it, like, he was pretty aggressive with that spin dash, even with the limit out. Um, considering he does have, like, armor on certain parts of the game, maybe on certain parts of the spin dash, and, uh, let's say it's pretty good. Although, not if you like mess up his back. Alright. Charging limit. Oh nice. Is that boy smash? Boy. 100% on his first stock. Are we gonna get a bracket reset? It's looking like Phoenix is hungry, man. And this is this is his second set, technically, against Dynamo. So, I, what I've seen, man, is Phoenix has been down 2-0 a lot today, or, or down games, and then he, like, fires up the Jets because he knows, like, all right, I learned, I got this much info from my opponent in these games, but use that to my advantage mm -hmm. and to destroy my, my, my foe. I mean, this is a situation, you know, when you get to grand final uh, game four, game five, those are usually, you know, full downloads from both players, and it looks like Dynamo is going to tell him, you know what, I also got the download on you, let me get it. finally get this cross slash going. But Phoenix gets the grab right away, putting Dynamo in a scary situation. Forcing Dynamo just to be scared to go for a couple of air dodges to get away. High throw, no kills, but does get Dynamo off the stage enough for Phoenix to find an edge guard. Yeah, these uh, downers are not really working out for Dynamo right now. As, uh, Phoenix has him scouted out and just punishing every single time. Hello? Oh no, there, there it is, the bracket, the bracket reset. reset. Team X nods, he's like, it's okay, I got four guys. Honestly though, like, like, you guys are joking, right? Like, oh, Sonic this, Sonic that, but like, none of these games have gone to time. None of them have really even been that long. That set itself was pretty fast. Like, to be fair, also, even when we saw Phoenix fight Karofax, like, he wasn't trying to go to time. It was actually, honestly, more fear no, yeah. of the trash can, of the of pit side B, than actual anything else because yeah. he knew he could have been cheesed out by like that read. For a while there, Phoenix, uh, Phoenix was rocking the. Uh, he, he's not like a, a campy Sonic by any means. Yeah. But he recognizes the strengths and weaknesses of his character. Yeah. So if he needs to, he knows how to play patient. For a while, he was actually rocking the Aegislash Slash tag. I don't know if you remember that. Ah, uh, it's actually my favorite Pokemon. But yeah. mine too. And I asked him why he was using that tag, and he said it was because of his favorite Pokemon. But I just assumed. It was because of how he should be playing, but yeah, he said it's my favorite Pokemon, and it reminds me how I should be playing. So Talking like, defense, exactly. So. And it really busted, busted <laughs> move called King Shield. King Shield is so godlike. <laughs> I think it was like banned. No, he wasn't banned it, in Pokemon, but it, like it's banned. I think from what I heard. I hear it's banned, but like in double fine because oh, like you can that do. Makes sense. You can like use Blow Whistle. Oh. oh, my man got stretched oh. away. That's not hot. Somebody call the ambulance, please. Get Sonic out of the stream because you know call the chat is not liking it. 
talking to the we're in the, we're in the, we're in the city of town and city, and I don't see the mayor at all. Well, in this game, oh no, wait, this is this is city folk. City folk, yeah, the mayor. You're the mayor. No, you're the mayor in, in, in uh, New League. New League. Oh, there you go. Yeah, the, the three years. I love Animal Crossing. So, but anyways. I can't wait for it to be the same. Oh. We're only one month away, man. We'll find out. Possibilities are endless. And just like this Grand Finals is because now we got Dynamo and Phoenix both losers. Dynamo, though, he was able to find a stretcher against Phoenix and tell him, you know what, take this trade, take this trip to the ambulance. Whoa. Let me get this. But Phoenix tells him, you know what, I heard you like being in the face. He's not far from the Oh, oh there it is. Dynamo says, you know what, I'm I'm done playing, dude. Right. I'm done. Um, um, so congrats, Dynamo, being up 1-0 so far in the set. I'm going to sneak in this comment real quick about Animal Crossing because you said we were one month away yeah. from finding out potentially. You know there was a leak recently, and the website has been like, the, the website has been like updated or, or is in construction. But the, the what I was going to say before this match gets on underway real fast is, you know how people are like, we're Smash at the end of a redirect? That was never me. I was literally like, where's Animal Crossing? Actually, <laughs> real, real, real talk, I thought, yeah, I was actually hoping for Animal Crossing. I'm like, where's Animal Crossing? Because I always thought like that was more likely than Smash Actually, I, I predicted that Animal Crossing was supposed to be announced in that direct, not oh, Smash. Yeah, I, I thought so too. Actually. I thought Smash was going to be for sure an E3 game, and then this month they would have been a direct. They'd be like, hey, here are the games we're going to have at E3, and Smash is going to be one of them, and then everyone would just pop up, and they're like, oh, by the way, we're covering Smash this E3. E3, our E3 will be dedicated to Smash, which is it. But, Nonetheless, things pay out differently, and I hope things will pay out differently for Dynamo this time because so far has one point on the board against Phoenix. Yeah, it looks like he's gonna rock the sheep the whole way through this time. I, I like it, dude. I, I like that Dynamo has basically become this player where he's so solid with Cloud, he can play the matchups, download his opponents, uh, and if it comes down to it, like he, un he unveils his final boss, his final form, like, oh, yeah. like. You, you, you got the read on my cloud, but here's my fresh sheep. Like, yeah. Yo, that's like Final Fantasy VII when you find like Sephiroth in the God War and you kill it and then you get the, the real Sephiroth. And that's like fantastic. <laughs> Still like that. Woo! Or smash across the stage. Just letting like, you know. Up. Just letting like, the final boss is. It's no joke. He's like the like secret boss in Kingdom Hearts for a reason. Oh, right, Sephiroth? Yeah. Spoilers! <laughs> Yo, man, we've had like several. Kingdom Hearts is an old game. <laughs> Didn't it look straight ass? Is like you guys can play it on PS2, PS3, and PS4. <laughs> what more do you want? Hey, for real. <laughs> <laughs> what more do you want from us? <laughs> Everyone's like, please just give us Kingdom Hearts 3. Stop giving us pointless sequels. Grab. Not gonna get the bounce fish. Confirm. Oh. He goes on the platform. Oh. Kind of one of those things that I do like that Animal's doing is using needles as much as possible because he sees the gap between him and Sonic. So if he throws out those needles and he stops Phoenix from pushing the spin dash, that's really good for him, yeah. especially. So he knows that with needles online with a character like Sheik, they put in a lot of good work against Sonic with spin dash. And that's where like um, your needle movement really comes into play, right? He's able to like pivot needle, shuffle needle, like uh, aerial. Like charge needles in these little moments and cancel. <gasps> that was unsafe. That up throw enough to kill. Uh, but yeah, so what I was saying is that the, the needles are so important because by stopping Sonic in his tracks when he's trying to spin dash approach you, it, it's like it's allowing, giving him time to like think, okay, how, what do I want to do? How do I, yeah. how do I pressure you into being where I want to? Like, I feel like getting my hits. Yeah, and I feel like needles work like an acupuncture in this game, and especially from Sheik. And no pun intended, because you know the acupuncture is. But like, they allow an opponent to be frustrated by them that they're forced to go another option. That you can actually force options like that. So it's potential that even when Dynamo tosses out those needles, he's just gonna force another option from Phoenix, or force a different playstyle. Right. Uh oh. The needles work so well, like, like you said, man. I can only call you, dude. It's Sonic loves the ledge, running back to the ledge, and that spacing between Sheik and Sonic from that distance 
Those needles do an amazing amount yeah. of work. Yeah, especially if, like, if you can convert to bouncing fish. Just keep them away in general. Add on damage. 81% to 103, though. Dynamo looking to put himself on the board up 2 0. If he can take it. Dynamo runs away from that opportunity. Holding Shield knows the spring ride was going to end right there with the hitbox from the spring itself. Over throw. Bouncing fish. Phoenix still living. Kind of one of the properties of actually, uh, I'm sorry, Lilat, is that the actual. Uh, Blast Zone actually moved away as the as the set. Oh. They shifted. Wow, going for an up air there instead of an up smash. I think he was uh, maybe not as uh, confident. In oh, there the it is. is. Nice. But yeah, he, maybe he wasn't as confident in the in the up air or the up smash because the last time he went for the up smash punch on the platform, he's like literally a pixel to the left. Yeah. And whiffed. But also. Seeing that the very next up air killed, he probably was thinking this upper will kill anyways, and it has a, uh, a larger area of effect, so less less of a chance of me whiffing the attack, more chances of me actually securing it. Yeah. Two, one, and also we saw him like play at the, uh, the platform, like around the platform, he was going for empty hops, looking for a possible opportunity to set up an up air or even an up smash, because that would have actually been a sweet spot, because of the way the platform was set up. Right. Like that. Unless Dynamo is up 2-0. Oh. I want to see him turn those points to the 0-2 oh, from the 0-3. Oh, so let's see how he's going to do it right now. He's doing it. Looking like the Sheik pick was probably the recipe that he needed to feed the Sonic. Yeah, I think the needles are really like what's doing the trick for sure. Yeah. Um, I mean, it's not like the needles are making Dynamo play anymore. Can't be patient, whatever. Like it's actually just because Sheik, Sheik's got the the aggressive potential as well. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking of aggression, dude, that's where it was. Kind of shifting his paradigm from charging needles to being a little defensive to being aggressive. But wow, wow. Phoenix, go bring me food. Because <laughs> he was just sitting next to you. He's like, hey, dude, I didn't bring you food. Remember that? Like we, we like you told Zeno like, hey man, just watch the stuff. I'll get you guys Starbucks. Zeno's is like, oh, I'll just go get myself a uh, shake shack and let nursemaid uh, struggle. Here we go, Dynamo making his way back into the game right here. 122% already on Phoenix. Uh, barely taking any percent of his own, only at 35. Yep. Oh. Nice power shield. Oh, nice. Oh, nice, good cover up. God, the pressure, dude. And it was beautiful because he was able to, like, uh, shield drop the blue platform. Not an easy thing to do. Here comes the four so pain from that combo. Even four years into the game, man, people are still struggling with that tech. Yeah. That's how you know you need to get another one, bro. Four years later, and you guys are still struggling with that tech. Although, it's safe to say, like, there have been patches, so. Fire right now, not trying to let Phoenix get in at all. He's trying to get that 3 0, man. Trying to let Nurseman go eat. Man, why you keep putting on me? I know you're hungry. <laughs> I'm trying to get him. I keep saying because I don't want to tell my mind I'm hungry. I'm trying to tell my mind to focus on So me. instead, tell me that I'm hungry. <laughs> <laughs> like, make me hungry. Right, I see you. I see you. <laughs> I'm sorry, fam. <laughs> All right, here's the forward tilt into up air, not enough to kill, but definitely gaining the stage for Dynamo and racking up the damage. Oh my god, this is I'll so throw. Dynamo this jumps is away, excellent opportunity there. Yeah, that would that would have been the uh, same way he took the first stock with the uh, up throw into uh, back air. Yeah, no vanish yet, but that up air. Oh, and it goes straight up. Oh my he god. Got the, he got the cross up. He got the cross yeah. up. Dynamo, ladies and gentlemen, your winner of Division 2 in the SoCal Smash League is none other than Enamine X Gaming's very own Dynamo Money. I, I N call him X Dynamo, yeah, yeah. Dynamo Money in the money. Got that's the big bucks, five hundred dollars for you, sir. That's half my that's half my rent, bro. Congratulations, man. Let's tell Dynamo if he wants to be awesome. my roommate. <laughs> like, yo, Dino, hey, you got that rent money though, right? <laughs> hey, Dino, are you trying to be my roommate, bro? I need that rent money. <laughs> I, need that, I need that rent money. Oh, man. So, uh, I don't know what their deal is here. 
I don't know. Uh, 60 seconds. 60 seconds? You for 60 seconds? Yeah. All right. All right. I'll take it. I'll take it over. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to do it. Oh, you want to <laughs> do it? Uh, I'll, if you want to do it, I'll, do, I'll do let it. you do it. No, All right. No, you, 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 you guys have more of a of a bond, you know, yeah. fat and stuff. Yeah, I've known I've known him since he was a young little I sapling. I, 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 like, I remember. I actually remember when like Alf was training. <laughs> oh, I remember that, dude. <laughs> so this was pretty much Dynamo like walking in the ground finals, right? And then he lost to Phoenix, and he was like, "Oh hell no!" That's what happened. <laughs> that's what pretty much. It's exactly what happened. Yeah. Huh? Oh yeah, we got six seconds. All right, six seconds. All right, so Dynamo, how do you feel about winning the SoCal Smash League Division Two? Feeling pretty good. I'm feeling like I'm uh, getting back towards a mindset that I uh, originally wanted mm -hmm. um, for this game, which is just to just to think about the game uh, and every move and step that I take about the game, rather than just um, trying to worry about my emotions mm -hmm. too much, because that's what's uh, that's what was getting in the in the way for me before. Like, and that's why I ended up getting a lot of uh, losses recently, but I'm glad to see that things are getting back on track now. All right, good. Well, what was your mindset coming into the SoCal Smash uh, League? Um, I thought at first it was, like, pretty good for me because um, I'm pretty sure I was seeded second based by points. Mm -hmm. So I, I, I just thought I wasn't going to do that bad. Like, either way, I still thought I was going to do pretty good, if not, like, win the whole thing. So Yeah. Did you, did you, like, what, what was your mindset coming into today, though? Like, I want to know, like, what were you thinking about? Like, who do I have to fight? What am I going to do? Because I you know, like, you and Kenny went back and forth looking at your stats. Uh, Kenny actually surpassed you, but that's only because he went to more tournaments than you did. So I don't know, what were your, what were your thoughts coming into today? I mean, uh, coming in for today, I wasn't entirely thinking about winning, considering the fact that I knew that there were like people that were seated above me. I just needed to focus on as much as I could of the game and just trying my best and making sure that I never um, let go of any opportunities that I have in the neutral. Mm -hmm. uh, are there any majors you're planning on going to? Um, majors I'm planning on going to are Hyrule Saga, of course. Mm -hmm. That's that's a guarantee. Um, potentially CEO, I'm not entirely sure about um, about that, but definitely Evo. You, okay. you guys are going to be seeing me at both of those tournaments, uh, Hyrule Saga and Evo. And then just for just for the chat, just so they can know, who do you want in Smash Switch? Like for sure, like who do you want? Like, if you have one character pick, who would it be? And I, who, do you, who do you want to see get nerfed? Who do I want to see get nerfed? All right, well here's the thing: who do I want in Smash? Probably, uh, if Cloud's not in the game and I want another uh, BS Sword character, probably Isaac from Golden Sun. Okay. I think he'd be really cool he'd to be, be really in the game. Either either Isaac from Golden Sun or, um, oh, I was going to say, um, I don't know. I think it'd be interesting to see like a new character, like a new, new, new character that okay. we haven't seen from like a new game yet. Mm -hmm. I think it'd be Ooh. pretty interesting to like see if, 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 if there's a character, character like that on the Switch or, or a Fire Emblem character. Because <laughs> like, there's a new Fire Emblem game coming out, so I don't know if I get a new Fire Emblem coming out. Either, either either Alm or Selk and Smash. I'd really love to see that actually. That okay. that would be the two other characters. Those would be the two other characters and I want to see. Who, who do you want to get nerfed in the game? Nobody. Just nobody. 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 Wow. I, I don't think anyone deserves a nerf in this game at this point, unless if it's like the new game comes out and then everything just kind of just changes automatically anyway. Mm -hmm. And if there's a character that I feel that people just generally feel like is really, really like overpowered or like dominating the meta, yeah. and like the people making the game just want to see some changes, I'm all for it. As long as it like doesn't get rid of anything, as long as you don't take anything away from the characters, but just like make it so that it's like nerfed and like damage or something else, but allows like. Like a different option. Kind of like how like we saw the, the like, Falcon nerf. Like it, yeah. it, it changed things, but allowed more combos. Yeah, people were allowed to uh, like people were kind of forced to do things uh, differently mm -hmm. when utilizing it. So that's pretty much all I'd really ask for if they are like nerfing things. Well, Dynamo. Don't get rid. Don't get rid of Sheik's down throw, please. Congratulations, please. my friend. Thank you. It's been. A, I've been watching you from a young kid. <laughs> I don't, God, four years ago, all and then way. all this way, man, taking your very first invitational and actual. Smash League, and you know, shout out to 2GG for putting this mm -hmm. all together, and of course, all those years of hard work finally paying off. First place, pretty much half my rent money in your pocket. <laughs> Congratulations, yeah. my friend. Thank it's you. It's been great to watch you grow. Thank Guys, you so much, man. Don't leave. We're gonna continue on with Division Numero Uno. All right, I can say when one thing. Back. One thing, really quickly. Uh, shout out to 2GG, of course, for the stream. Shout out to INX, mm -hmm. of course, my sponsor. Oh, These guys are doing really well. Um, Shout out to my family, all my friends, and all the people that are watching and rooting for me. I like, really appreciate all your support, guys. It really means a lot. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, that's all I got to say. Yeah, we're good. Can... Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. All right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I figured okay. that. All right, all, right, all, right. all right. See you guys later.
Okay. Yeah. Yo, what is up, my man? Uh, what was your name again, sir? Just for the stream. Rusty. Rusty, pleasure yeah. meeting you. Pleasure being in this fine establishment today. I want to ask you, man, what is e Coliseum? First of all, before I ask you that, yeah. great name, by the way. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, you know, the name actually came from, uh, like, a majority of the team actually goes to USC. Mm -hmm. And so we were like, oh, LA Coliseum.